Hi, this is Lee from Change for ME with part four of my hospital visit video series. And um, I'm having an endoscopy or a gastroscopy this morning. And I'm just waiting for them to come and take me away. And uh, I'm a little bit concerned about what the sedation might do to me. Um, but I did give the doctor a, um, a printout that I had of a document written by Dr. Paul Cheney, which um, discusses um, what kind of appropriate sedation and anaesthetics are suitable for people with ME-CFS. And it also mentions things like um, use of oxygen and uh, the dangers of oxygen toxicity for us so uh, my doctor should be well enough informed to make the right decision so um, I'll get back to you after the endoscopy and we'll see how it went I'm back but I'm a zombie so I'll talk some more after I've had some lunch Well, it's three hours since I had my endoscopy, and uh, I've just woken up, really. <sighs> I still feel pretty zonked, but um, I don't feel too bad, actually, surprisingly. So that's a good thing. Um, uh, before I went in, the, uh, the guy doing the anaesthetic came and had a chat to me, and... Uh, he said that he'd uh, go really easy and um, probably just start with a quarter of the amount that he would normally administer and see how that goes. So I'm not really sure how it ended up, but all is fine, so they must have done a, a good job. Um, one thing I did notice was uh, as they uh, wheeled me from my room here downstairs to where they performed the endoscopy. Um, just going through all the corridors, I was really overwhelmed with the the smell, the hospital smell, which I guess is, you know, it's all the chemicals they use to keep it sanitary. And uh, by the time I got down there, I was feeling really quite nauseous. Um, I had informed them that I'm sensitive to chemicals and um, they've actually been really good about that. They've put signs up everywhere and. Um, they put a tag on my arm with an alert thing on it so that anybody coming into contact with me knows. And uh, they did mention it to me once I was downstairs. They checked that with me. Uh, but, you know, just the general cleanliness of the hospital, I guess, requires that there are chemicals everywhere, so it's unavoidable, really. But mm, it did make me feel quite nauseous and horrible. But I'm OK now, so no complaints. Anyway, that's enough for today, so that drama over. Um, tomorrow I am having a... Tomorrow I'm having a CT scan on my abdomen, and I'm also booked in to get a biopsy done on my thyroid, because there's a nodule they found. Uh, so tomorrow will be another day that will probably wipe me out. Anyway... Uh, I'll update you again soon. Bye.